Petal Girls or Betelgeuse. It's a red giant star. If you put it where the sun is, it will extend out to the orbit of Jupiter. It's enormous. It's very unstable. It's about to explode. They are among the biggest explosions of radio energy in the entire universe. They generate more energy than a billion suns. The energy and radio frequencies are so great that eventually the entire universe will be aware of this one explosion. Brace yourselves for a cosmic cataclysm of unprecedented proportions. Betelgeuse, the red giant star poised on the edge of our galaxy, is sending ominous signals through the universe. Using the James Webb Space Telescope, astronomers have uncovered something profoundly unsettling about this colossal celestial body. As renowned astrophysicist Brian Cox issues a grave warning, the question looms. Are we on the precipice of witnessing a catastrophic supernova explosion that could forever change the night sky as we know it? Let's dive in. In the grand tapestry of the cosmos, where stars are born, live, and die in spectacular fashion, one star has recently captured the imagination and concern of astronomers and the public alike. This star is Betelgeuse, a red supergiant of immense proportions and age, situated conspicuously in the constellation Orion. Its distinctive reddish hue and variable brightness have long been a source of intrigue, but recent developments have intensified interest in this celestial giant. As we explore the nature of Betelgeuse, we find ourselves on the cusp of a potentially monumental event in the life cycle of this star. But what could these changes in Betelgeuse signify? Are we witnessing the prelude to a cosmic spectacle of unimaginable scale? Betelgeuse, approximately 764 times larger than our sun, is a stellar behemoth. Its colossal size is almost beyond human comprehension. Imagine a star so vast, were it to replace our sun, its surface would extend beyond the orbit of Mars, engulfing Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars in its stellar embrace. This incredible size is not just a testament to Betelgeuse's physical attributes, but also speaks to its stage in the stellar life cycle. As a red supergiant, Betelgeuse is in the twilight of its existence, a phase characterized by expansion and cooling following a life spent fusing hydrogen into helium in its core. But what about the age of Betelgeuse? This star, believed to be around 8 to 8.5 million years old, is relatively young in human terms but ancient in the context of stellar lifetimes. Its current red supergiant phase is the culmination of millions of years of stellar evolution, a period marked by dramatic changes and processes that have transformed it from a hot blue star to the red giant we see today. The life cycle of stars like Betelgeuse is a story of transformation, driven by the relentless forces of nuclear fusion and gravity. Betelgeuse's distinctive reddish hue is another hallmark of its current stage. The red color is a result of its relatively cooler surface temperature compared to other stars like our sun. While the sun's surface temperature is about 5,500 Kelvin, Betelgeuse's cooler surface registers temperatures around 3,500 Kelvin. This cooler temperature allows Betelgeuse to emit light at wavelengths that give it a red appearance. But this color is not just a visual trait. It provides clues about the star's physical condition and the processes occurring within its vast, gaseous expanse. Adding to Betelgeuse's mystique is its historical color change. Ancient Roman and Chinese writings suggest that around 2,000 years ago, Betelgeuse was yellow. It was only in the 9th century that Arabic scholars first described it as red. This color shift over human history is not just a detail in the annals of astronomy, but a clue to the star's evolutionary path. The variable brightness of Betelgeuse is another intriguing aspect. It's a semi-regular variable star, which means its light periodically waxes and wanes, and this variability is a characteristic dance of luminosity that has fascinated astronomers and sky watchers for centuries. Typically, Betelgeuse undergoes a 400-day cycle, along with a longer cycle that stretches about five years. These cycles have been documented as far back as 1836 by Sir John Herschel, and possibly even earlier in Aboriginal oral traditions. But what makes Betelgeuse truly enigmatic is not just its changing brightness, but its irregularity. Unlike many stars that follow a predictable pattern, 
Betelgeuse occasionally deviates from its rhythmic dimming and brightening, hinting at complex and less understood processes occurring within its colossal form. In a recent groundbreaking revelation, Betelgeuse captured the attention of astronomers and 